One of the things leaders has to do all the time is make decisions. And those decisions, like a dropping a stone in a pond, have a ripple effect. They influence many things. The bigger the decision, the bigger the waves, the more impact on the shore. The smaller the decision, the smaller the pebble, but it's always a decision that has consequences. So we need to make sure the decisions that we make are right. How do we do that? Well, one of the ways is before we make the final decision to get input from people. The folks that are going to have to implement the decision may have something to contribute. Well, if that's what you want to do, I think we should do this or that. You could get input from your boss, who's probably been there before and done that a few times. You can get input from your colleagues, who are going to have to help you, perhaps, with the implementation. You could reach outside and get input from friends in other industries who've done something similar. But the input that we get gives us information that allows us to make a better decision. Once we've got enough input, we can then make that decision with more confidence, assign that decision to the team that's going to execute, and then hold them accountable to execute that. Now, I once had an interesting experience. I was sharing this thought with the group, and they said, you know what? We're going to put that into practice. And in fact, they were simply reorganizing the parking lot. And you would think, OK, redesigning a parking lot. I mean, how hard is that? But the individual charged with making the decision went to the people who parked their cars every day and said, my job is to reorganize the parking lot. What input do you have? And they had a lot of input because they were thinking about the number of people that came after they delivered their kids at school, traffic flow, entrance, exits. They were the people that were using the parking lot every day. And as a result of that input, he redesigned the parking lot and he said it was way better than if I simply made the decision on my own. So I would encourage you, before you make the decision, get input, then make the decision, assign the task, and hold the folks accountable.